so you can choose one of these links uh, to look for any BIM object in, in, in different libraries. Also, there are a lot of other libraries in which you can find some useful information which you can use in your BIM projects. So, for our example, we will use BIM objects, and in BIM objects, I start my search and I need roof. When I type a uh, keyword, uh, program suggests me some combination of keywords. Let's say I need a construction roof with all the layers. So I can choose uh, any of these uh, uh, constructions. Let's say I, I want to have all the layers and all the materials uh, which are in, in, in all the in, in, in the roof. So, from my project, I know my roof is sloped, so I will try to use an uh, example from here. Uh, from here, I can check links, some basic information. Also, I can see what are examples of usage of this product. Uh, also, I can see 3D model of the roof. So from here I see it looks maybe this roof will be suitable for my project because it has layers and let's try to download it. Okay, so I download it, look for international version. Also I can download uh, good quality texture files, maybe some uh, files for Archicad and let's say I need for Revit, I download and I open it in Revit. When you open you sometimes need to wait a couple of seconds or minutes to upgrade the project to the newest version of your Revit. Double tap on this example, I press edit type and I check if all the layers are correctly assigned. Okay, so let's say these layers are suitable for me and I can try to use this for my project. So I can use a copy-paste technique and the roof is inserted in my project. Also, I can use transfer project standards and I can transfer this uh, example from uh, roof, roof types. I press OK and it should upload all the types from the file which I opened before. 